Hey guys, it's me. So today we've got a really exciting surprise for everyone. We are going to be unboxing the brand new G7 LPS. Let me just get them in here for you guys. All right, so here are the ones I got in all their glory. Just so you guys can see, uh, here's a size comparison with my mascot. As you can see, it is huge. All right, so to start us off today, we are going to open up this pet trio. Ooh. And let's just get a close look at the packaging. This is the Wild Vibes set. Sadly, at my Target, they didn't have the Island Vibes, but it's all right. It's good to get at least some of the pets as they start trickling into stores. Okay, so it seems the best way to open it with preserving the packaging is if you go up at the top, there will be two pieces of tape right here, and you just slide that off, and then your pets should just slide right out. And there they are! How beautiful. How cute. Alrighty, we got all the pets unboxed. Now let's take a look at what we got. So to start us off, in the back of the packaging was this little pamphlet. I believe it comes with a token and a card. So let's just take a look at which card I got. So it looks like I got the card for the little rhino, which is so cute. He's one of my favorite from the set. And sadly, because of the packaging, the way it was rounded, it did get a bit bent, but hopefully if I finagle it a little bit, it'll get all back in shape. So in the little packet came our little token with our code, but we are going to save that for later and redeem that in the game. And then lastly, it came with this adorable little pamphlet, which is so nostalgic. It tells you all the pet different pets that you can get. All right there. And then it also has a little rarity and their personalities and their levels, which is super, super duper cute. So next, we're gonna take a look at the pets. So the first one we have coming in is this adorable little iguana. He is so pretty. I love his little star on the front of his chest. I love the texture of his little spikes. I've never had an LPS iguana before. So this is pretty exciting. Our next pet we have is the new little axolotl. He is so precious. I love the little stars on his cheeks and his side and the little ombre on the tail is just precious. I'm very excited to see this new mold and also the bobble on these little guys is so awesome. And lastly, we're going to take a look at our little rhino. He is actually quite large in comparison to my mascot. He's got these cute little freckles on his cheeks, and he's got the little stars in his ears. And I love all the little rhino wrinkles in his tail. And lastly, we're going to take a look at the little accessory. This seems to be one that they're kind of favoring. I've seen them in the blind boxes and stuff. It's just this little bamboo. Okay, and that's it for this pet trios. Let's take a look at our next one. And just like the last one, we're gonna start ourselves off with the trading card. So the one that we got with this set was the cute little Yasa Opso, which is so adorable. I love this silly little dog. <laughs> and then next, we're gonna take a look at our pets. So the first pet that came in this set What's the quail? I love her colors. She reminds me a lot of the Mommies and Babies peacock. Um, yeah, and she's got really cute little stars on her wings or diamonds. I will say with this specific pet, it doesn't seem like she likes to stand very well, but if you get her just right, she'll stand for you. The next pet I'm gonna take a look at is this cute little kitty. So she's a lucky cat or a money cat, whichever you'd prefer. Um, and this is one of my favorite molds. I've never had this mold either. I've never had a lot of these molds. Um, but she's just so pretty. I love her little sparkles on her cheek. 
She is similar to a pet we've had before, but I like that they've made the redesigns a little bit different. It's very cute. Okay, and lastly, we're gonna look at the Lhasa Opso. She is so cute. Her body is so tiny. <laughs> I just love her big ol' ears and her big fluffy tail. And her little bow is just perfect. She's got a cute little tongue. It looks like it was a little bit misprinted, but nothing a little paint won't fix. And I love how the diamonds with like negative space, I think that's really cute. The set also came with a little bowl. Now let's just put these guys aside and we'll move on to the next set. Okay, so our next and final set is the Fun Factory play set, which comes with a cute little corgi and a little hamster. So if we take a look at the packaging, of course the front has the little logo and it shows you all the accessories it comes with and includes a virtual code and has our little panda mascot. The top of the box has the super cute little timber wolf as well as the hamster. And then as we turn it around, we can see the quail and the monkey. And then at the back, we can see the whole set and they're playing with the pelican and the little iguana. I think it's so cute to see this packaging again. It just reminds me so much of when they used to be in stores. And then we've got the timber wolf and the hamster again. And that is our packaging. It looks like the easiest way to open it up is if we come up to the top, there will be two pieces of tape right here. And then you could just pop it open, like so. Alright, and I'll see you guys when it's all opened up. And here is the set all put together. So it comes with this cute little hamster, which is a remake of an old hamster. And it also comes with this adorable corgi, and I love the little flashes in their ears. We'll take a, a closer look later. So the rest of the features is it has this spinning hamster ball, which you can pop out. And then if you just twist it, it opens. And then it easily just pops right back in. And also the little hamster guy, he can do a little spin around here. And then on the other side, there's a little bird perch or a little peg to put any of your other pets. We've got these cute little stylized tubes so you can pretend like your pets are crawling through. And I love the little cheese hide and the little water bottle. And the water bottle does just pop off. I do feel that the water bottle's not very secure, but it'll stay there for now, as long as I don't mess with it too much. And then on the other side with the corgi, at the back of the hamster wheel, there is a lever and you can spin it and make your corgi run. Now let's go take a look at the accessories and a closer look at our pets. Alrighty, and so to start us off, we're going to take a look at our little trading card. With this pack, we got the little hamster. It shows that they're hungriest, they're level 3, and they're an exotic. They're number 68. And then the back is the same as the other ones. It's very cute. I love the little artwork and I love the little hamster. Next, we're going to take a look at our accessories. So this playset came with a little piece of cheese with a little cherry on top, a bundle of carrots, another pink food bowl, two green apples, and two red apples. Yummy! This is very exciting to me because I don't really have a whole lot of LPS food. This will definitely help me jumpstart my collection. Okay, last but not least, let's take a look at our pets. So the first pet we're going to take a look at is this cute little corgi. I will say, the first thing I notice is the bobble isn't as good as the other pets. They're just kind of stiff, but I think that's just pretty normal, pretty standard with the corgis. So this adorable little cutie has their little paws colored in, which is an adorable little detail. And then they've got the cute little pink LPS logo on their back and the cute little uh, lightning bolts in their ears. <laughs> their ears are so big, it looks like they could almost fly away with them. <laughs> and our last pet for today is our little hamster with the apple. I think this hamster is so, so precious. When I was younger, I used to have the original version of this hamster, and so this brings back a lot of good memories. I love her flowers on her head and her ears, and I love 
her little spot on her eye. She's just so cute. I will say that makes me a little sad is this hamster does have a little bit of a chip in the in the side of her mouth. Um, I have tried to chip it off, but it's just a chip in her plastic, which is a little upsetting, but I'll be all right. <laughs> Okay, and here is a little overview of all the pets that we got today. I am so excited to have more LPS and I can't wait to see what else they do. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you liked it, feel free to give it a like. Um, comment something down below if you'd like me to make more videos. This was just a silly one-off thing I was thinking about doing with my new LPS. And yeah, look forward to seeing you guys later. Bye-bye.